It was a, an interview we did with Sky Television from Britain. Two piles, we found them in Berry. Two piles of 10 children each were tied back to back and burned to death. Now again, I mean, if we, if we look at the, the death figures at Berry, there are, there are only 10 children that died at Berry. Well, not children, it's about uh, it's 18 year old. Uh, so we all together, when you look at them and they're burned, you don't know exactly the ages. So you're talking about 18 year old, uh, 20 years old, and uh, you can't, you, you, you can't, you just don't look on the spot um, identification to see the ages or something like that. It is not the only questionable story that Yossi Landau tells about Kibbutz Beri. We go further. Then we see a woman. She was lying on the floor, a puddle of blood, a big puddle of blood. She was a pregnant woman. Her stomach was butchered open. The baby that was connected to the cord was stabbed. And she was shot in the back. Kibbutz Beri has denied this account. The story of the pregnant woman reported by Zaka is not relevant to Beri. Yossi Landau insists he witnessed this scene at Beri. If you want to see the picture, I have the picture of it. Are you able to share the photographic evidence yes, with us? Uh, to show you. Yes. Where's my phone? Oh, I'm sorry. I will, I will not put it in front of the no, camera. No, no, that's fine. I'll, I'll come and look. This is the knife they used. Shot and killed, but... Over here was the woman. But that's the imagery after the bodies had been cleared away. Oh. Yes. This is the baby. This is it. I'm sorry to be graphic here, but I, I can't see a baby here. You can't see the baby because... But this is the picture of the, of the mother. Okay. For sure, you know, we didn't think when we were over there, we didn't think to, to, to camera everything. We didn't have that. This wasn't in our... The photo shows an unidentifiable piece of charred flesh. The list of the dead contains no victim that fits Yossi Landau's description. On October 7th, two babies die. One is killed when a bullet is fired through a door. The other dies following an emergency caesarean after the mother is shot. Neither is burned or beheaded. You being someone who, with your own hands, with your own eyes, with your nose, you smelled this, what would you say to, to that person who, who is downplaying what took place here? I wouldn't say anything. I would ask, please give me, I sh he should be together with the Hamas terrorist and he should be killed because he's a part of it. 